it and go. Now, <laughs> the first one, excuse me. <clears throat> as you can see here, uh, those of you who know Dragon Ball know that this guy is probably, I call him the bravest dude in the whole show because he's a, he's a simple human. This guy comes out of a, a space pod and this is Raditz. Of course he comes out of a space pod and then blows his car. He's like, wait a minute, bro. Uh, -uh we're not doing this. <laughs> he loads up the shoddy. And tries to go at him, but his power level was way too weak to be dealing with Raddus. As you can see, he catches the bullet, flicks it back at him. Whole problem, right? So if you don't power up, if you don't level up, if you don't know what your power level is, you're going to walk into a situation and have no clue that you're about to get obliterated. You have no clue that you're not ready for the situation. Okay. So number one is going to be what is your power level all right what is your power level um <clears throat> you're going to evaluate your current state and these are the areas that you're going to evaluate your life in these areas you're going to evaluate um where you are okay health and fitness your intellectual life and emotional life uh, your character and spirituality love and relationships family um, social life financial finances and career um, those are the things that you want to look into and you're going to, you're going to analyze them. You know what I'm saying? Give yourself a simple one to 10 on each one. Uh, where am I at? Where do I feel I'm at with my health? Where am I with my fitness? Where am I at with my, my character, how I am as a person day to day? Where am I at with my spirituality? Um, what about how do I love? Not just, not just, you know, romantically, but how do I love myself? How do I love my family? How do I love my kids? Um, how do I show love to those, to those randomly I run across? Okay. You got to be able to, to characterize those and quantify those because if you can't quantify them, then there's no way for you to measure it. Measurements have to have quantity. Okay. So that's the first thing you got to sit there, take your time and scale everything. All right. Now, next part, the next part that I want you to look into is what is the area that your dream falls in? Let's think about that. Everybody has a dream, right? That's, that's what you're, that's what you're leveling up to try to get to. You're trying to get to that dream state, the place where your dream and your reality are the same, right? Uh, at one point I wrote something years ago, years ago, uh, some, a poem that I did. Um, by the way, I do spoken word. I'll be doing some, I'll do a spoken word night one night here, one of these days. But, um, uh, the, what I wrote was, is, is life a dream or is a dream your life? The day you see no difference is the day you've learned to live. Okay. And you've got to, you got to get to that point. Everyone die is dying to get to that point. Right. So in doing this and doing what we're working on right now and looking at what your power level is, you're trying to figure out how can I get to this dream straight, uh, dream state, forgive me. Uh, yeah. Dream state. Okay. How do I get to this dream state? Um, which one of these areas, you know, one through six that I've got here and really it'd be one through 12 because you really could break each one of those down into its own line. Uh, but you know, I kind of, brought them together just for simplicity for us. Um, but which area does it fall into? Which area does your dream fall into? And what was your score on that area? Were you a five? Were you a four? Were you a 10? You know, 10 being the highest, I'm thinking one to 10. Uh, were you a 10? How does that look to you? How was that for you? Okay. Um, you got to know. You got to know where you currently sit. You got to know where you're trying to get. All right. Where do you currently sit and where are you trying to get keywords with that? All right. Um, the next thing you want to look into is with your dream. Can you see it and can you see it clearly? Cause you got to be able to see it clearly. All right. Got to be able to see it clearly in order to understand. So that takes us into step number two.